welcome to another vlog. You know, the whole world knows about Megan Fox. I think I've only seen one of her movies, but uh, I like her. I saw her in an old uh, episode of Two and a Half Men. I thought she was really funny. You know, and I think she's really smart to align herself with geeky boys and men, and even some geeky girls dig her, and, and young girls don't seem to be threatened by her, so that's pretty awesome. And, and her beauty mixed with her geekiness seems to have allowed young girls to feel good about themselves. And, you know, that's always a good thing. And you know, there's something... There's something appealing about a beautiful person that doesn't act all hot, but rather, you know, appears to, you know, they seem like they are completely unaware of their own beauty, and I think that's kind of cool. And if a pretty person has a so-called defect, like a club foot or one eye or stubby arms, baldness, web toes, extra nipples, um, you know, like second, maybe the second toe is longer than the big toe, you know, it seems to make them, you know, more interesting somehow. Freakish, but, you know, still very lovable in a lot of ways. Anyway, much has been made about Megan Fox's big thumb. I know it's no surprise, right? You've heard about her. She has this giant, you know, nasty-looking thumb. And it's, it's really like having a big toe grafted onto your hand by Frankenstein. I mean, I think it's called brachydactyly or something like that. I think that's the medical term. It's like having a club foot, but it's a club thumb. And it's like the heroine in Even Cowgirls Get the Blues. You know, it's like having a giant 8-inch thumb. It's like that rubber thumb that secretaries sometimes put on their fingers when they're flipping through papers. Uh, it's like a thumb condom. But anyway, this is her natural nasty thumb. Anyway, the Super Bowl ad comes out, right? It's, got, it's about Motorola and Megan Fox is all nude in the tub and she's using the phone and then suddenly, out of nowhere, it's a stunt thumb. Obviously not hers. You know, they found a pretty thumb model. You know, she was hired. They went to a thumb model agency and you know, obviously a supermodel. You know, just her thumb is the supermodel, I suppose. Uh, she's probably hideous. You know, she's probably a, a butterfinger. Everything's, well, no, that wouldn't be right. Her, she's probably a butter body. It's just only her thumb is beautiful, and they hired her. Uh, and, uh, you know, anyway, they, we see this ad, and the Internet goes crazy because we all know Megan Fox has a big, nasty toe thumb. And somehow Motorola has decided, well, we're going to just cover it all up with this ad. And I hate to be like a conspiracy theorist, theorist or whatever it's called, but, you know, it's, it's a giant cover-up. And, you know, I've been reading some blogs and getting some emails from them. And there's, like, a lot of little girls out there with similar defects. You know, and they've, you know, they're crying. They, you know, they feel betrayed. And it's sad, really. And, um, anyway, forget all that. I, I hope you check out my podcast. Hope you subscribe. Hope you comment. And like many of the listeners of the show, you know, feel free to send me gifts. I mean, this is pretty awesome. I got these from a, a fan named Erin. And, you know, like myself, she's a big... Well, look at this. Check this out, you know. I'll go ahead and show you. I know you were probably expecting, like seen, you know, Megan Fox in the nude, but check these out. How cool is that? Is that awesome or what? You know, and thanks to uh, dieting for, um, you know, the last three months, I can actually fit into Batman underoos. So, you know, feel free to send me gifts. It's awesome. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to check out the podcast. See you on the next one. Adios. And Jerry has a Facebook friend.